if he no born, he no done. Well, that burger may born because he may overdone. Who got better chicken? They said the better chicken. All right. <laughs> I was hoping you say that. They got a straw. Because I, I hate drinking coconut the way they do it like that. I gotta get all of my shit. I'm, I'm incredibly messy. Pepper and cheese. This is, in Spanish they call this racasun. What? Racasun. 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 Oh yeah. I got no idea what racasun is. It looks good though. Cottage cheese. Oh, cottage cheese. Ah yeah. Do you know why they have these bags? If you know why, let me know in the comments. I'll tell you why. Hey there guys, greetings from San Ignacio town, Belize. We are in the Cayo district and the town is San Ignacio. We're taking the little hibiscus arch trail. And today we are heading towards the market. I hope we're still early enough because it's 8.30 in the morning. Hope it's not too late. Hopefully things are still happening around here. Because we went, did some karaoke last night at Serendib. So getting up early is sometimes hard for us. But here we are doing it just for you. And they say the market is very lively here. So let's go check it out. See what it's like. San Ignacio Cayo, here we go. Hope you guys enjoy these videos. Don't forget to leave me a comment, please. And if you haven't subscribed, please do so also. Look at that, strange looking taxi. Let's see if I can find the market. I think it was down here. Not a hundred percent sure. Guys, I'm loving it here in San Ignacio, Cayo. It is beautiful. It's a really nice town. It's very well developed. They've done a lot of good stuff with the town. A lot of improvements, making it fancy. Good morning, how are you? Good alright. My name is Benson. Yeah. Well, right now I only have this little arts here. It's, today is a Saturday and I'm a Luna on a Saturday. But I'm so glad to be alive. Cheers to all and all, to all my Facebook friends and whosoever may be watching this video. Welcome to Belize, blessed weekend. Um, as a Belizean, I have this arts going on right here. I just sometimes I do bigger ones or sometimes I do something that says Belize. Um, I just here to like share the interview. I'm so glad to be alive. Like I say, grew up with all my father. But in life, when you come to Belize, people to ask for Benson Crawford, or you could call me at 501 626 5352. The reason I probably call myself because here in Belize it's not so easy, but we live to make it a better Belize and we want future endorsement. Um, cheers to one and all in the month of September, which is Belize's birthday. Uh, will be like part three years in the system, but more love to Belize and all the visitors coming in to this Mayan jewel to, to see, snorkel, dive, do all the good chores in life. It's a nice romantic destination paradise. Peace out, one love. What's your name, sir? Uh, Doug P. Vlogs. All right, yeah, I'm Benson. Benson, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. And you get a little future endorsement. Don't forget to remember me because uh, I, I really need support in my life. and. Yeah, and every support goes a long way. Yeah, so yeah. People, people, people could visit you, All could right. see you and, and pick up some of your artwork Yeah, and stuff yeah, like some that. art times I do other ones too. I have a whole bunch, but... Yeah, let me shine on that from close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, like I say, yeah, it has in the nose, the mouth, the eyes, and come from an ancient rustic man material. Sometimes, like I said, I do something that says Belize, so feel free to Come see me, right, endorse yeah, yeah. me. Here I am protecting this guy right here with his brochure. So yeah. more endorsement as well. And I'm a future loving Belizean. Glad to do this. Right. Cheers on the weekend. All right, nice meeting you. Yeah, man, hope, yeah. I hope you get some good luck and sell yeah. a bunch of stuff, you know? Sir, I don't want a big piece of something. Uh, right now I'm circling around, so. All right, all right. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you though. All right, yeah. yeah, yeah. 
you know something good with the video from me, from me sir because i always need endorsement down here in belize oh yeah this is gonna be on this is gonna be on youtube all right right there on the channel i gave you yes 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 yeah, sure yeah. I, i'll have hook it up and see it maybe yeah, in so a week time or two weeks yeah probably in a week time something yeah, like that. yeah interesting that way people see it you know they can on, yes. pick up some of your artwork yeah, yeah, you know, and, and things socialize like that. and yeah exactly all right take care Thank man you. likewise good morning so here we are in the market busy busy market morning Wow, the selections here are great. Very good selections. A lot of fruits, veggies. Everything looks fresh. Nice. Look at the seven years paintings, slate carvings. Awesome stuff. Morning. What's up, amigo? Hey, how are you? Good, good, man. Got some nice art, right? Hey, what's this made out of? Out of stone, slate. Slate? Out of slate? Wow. Out of slate art. You make it? Yeah, I'm the artist, man. You're the artist, wow. I do good stuff, man. Look at that, guys. I can get a piece, man. Where, where yeah. you get the slate from? In the jungle, where I can get it. In the jungle? In the jungle? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Cool. Where are you from? Me, from Corozal. Oh, Corozal? Yeah. Yeah, man. All right, nice. Hi, Corozal. Hi. Say hi to your friends. I am from Corozal. You're from Corozal? Really? Yeah. All right. How your name? Karim. Karim? Karim Gasham. Karim Gasham from Corza. All right, cool. Morning, sir. Take your right. How are you? Hello. I have the public bathroom there if you need to use the bathroom. And people here selling their wares. Clothes, shoes, phone covers. What is this? Hello. Say hi. Hi. Hello. How are you guys? We're good. What are you selling here? And as you can see, a little bit of everything. Footwear, cups, we have everything. Uh, so you're here every every day selling? Every Saturday. Every Saturday you come out selling. Yeah. Cool. For how many long time? Years now? Years wow. Now. How is business? Up and down. Up and down. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. It can never be the same every time. Right. Yeah. 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 So what's your name? Carla. Carla. All right. Send, say hi to your friends. They're gonna see this on Facebook, on YouTube. Okay. Hi yeah. everyone. I'm gonna advertise the video on Facebook. We're here in San Ignacio. I know. Police. They really. Ignacio Cayo District. I surprised they really fix up San Ignacio nice. They're yeah. doing a good job. Still can be better. Oh, everything could be better. Yeah. 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 Right. All right, nice meeting you. Back here is the dining area, the restaurant. Food court, I guess you could call it. Hustle and bustle of the market. Good morning. I have to duck every now and then because there's some low parts. Look here you can get hammocks. Handmade hammocks. But these here are made with Guatemalan cloth. So these are probably Guatemalan hammocks. I think that's what they are. That looks more like a Mexican style hammock. But yeah, this is definitely a Guatemalan style hammock. They are neat. Wow, 
Wow, look at this. All hand woven stuff. You got the Belize logo on it. Those hammocks are Guatemalan hammocks? Huh? Which? Guatemalan style, these? Well, they bring it from here. They bring it from Guatemala? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, uh, how, mu how much one like that? Um, 50. 50? $50 Belize, 25 US. Cool. Very nice stuff here. Look, little bags for your kids. <laughs> You've got modern, up to date stuff. How's business? Uh, so so. Not really good, but nice. Yeah. And you come out here every day? Um, just on Saturdays. Oh, just on Saturdays you sell. Yeah. All right. Lots of luck. I hope you sell everything. You want to say hi to your friends? Hi. Hey, what's your name? Um, Jonathan. Huh? Jonathan. Jonathan. All right. Nice meeting you, Jonathan. We'll check you out on YouTube. You guys take in the sights and the sounds. Libre. again <laughs> we meet again oh my god I, just, I can't get rid of I you just, listen turn off my camera here I need you I guys I had some garbage I was gonna throw it in here and I asked good thing I asked and they said it's not garbage you, good I good thing you, you when you come back you look it's full of garbage <laughs> then you gotta throw it away yeah, yeah give me more job <laughs> exactly too much work yes. I almost threw garbage into her barrel where she where she stores the stuff that she sells. See, she sells that. And I guess when she goes home, she puts it in the barrel to travel. So we're back in the fruit and veggie section. Good morning. Wow. What is this? What is this? What kind of fruit is this? Como se llama esto? Oh, pitaya, dragon fruit. Oh, this is dragon fruit. Oh, look at those. Those look good. <laughs> wow, the fruit and veggie section here in San Ignacio is absolutely awesome I have to say that this is one of the best produce markets I have seen to date it's really good He's preaching. He got a loud voice. He has a very loud voice. He needs a loudspeaker. Look at the habanero peppers. Look at that. Habanero. How much are the bag of habanero? Five dollars? Five dollars. Whoa, they look like they burn. <laughs> they look like they're hot. Yeah. This what is this here? 
Huh? What is this? Other chicoloro. Chicoloro? Yeah. What is chicoloro? I forget to put in the paper. Oh, you forget about that one. The only one I look is the one that doesn't yes. have. Yes. What is chicoloro? Chicoloro good for gastritis pain. Oh, good for gastritis pain. Yes. Uh, what do you do? You boil it? You have to boil it and you put on heat of garlic and put a ginger. Oh, boil it with garlic and yes. ginger. Wow. It's very good. Yeah. It's like wood, wood barks, right? Huh? It's like wooden bark. Yeah. Smell nice. That's very good. Yeah. Cool. You have a lot of pain. Huh? Have you got a lot? If you have a lot of pain, that, that's for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take care of all the pain, yeah. yeah. Wow. Yes. Jungle medicine, right? Yes. Wow, neat. This? I've never seen this. What is this? Kalawala. Huh? Kalawala. Kalawala. That's good for prostate. For what? Inflammation for prostate. For prostate? Ah, uh, you have good for, for stomach. Ah. Wow, Kalawala. Yes. Do you guys know this Kalawala, thing? Kalawala is a good medicine. Yeah. Look at Kalawala. Uh, how you eat, how you do this? You, you peel the skin. Yeah. And then you mash it and you put it, you boil it in Oh, water. you boil it and you drink it? Yes. Wow. That's very good. I never hear about this stuff in my life. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's very good. Yeah. Kalawala, guys. Yes. Wow, thank you. So you sell here every every Saturday or every day? Every Saturday. Every Saturday you sell only here? Saturday, yeah. Oh, only Saturdays? Yes. Very good. And you grow your own okra and everything? Huh? You grow that yourself? On your farm? This, this yeah. One? You grow it on your farm? Uh, or you buy and resell? I, I buy this, this year I buy it. Yeah, oh, you buy those and those yes. resell those? Yes. All right. I like those habaneros. They look yeah. Dude, that's good. Well, there is $5 for the bag. $5 for a bag? That's a deal. $5 for a bag. That there is it's cheap. Dollar. These are a dollar bag. Yes. Dollar bag Gavanero. Yes. Wow. Nice. Well, I wish you lots of luck. I hope you sell everything. What's your name? Ubencio Canto. Ubento? Ubencio Canto. Ubencio Canto. All right. Nice meeting you. <laughs> Thank you for talking to me. Thank you. All right. So. Learned some new stuff there, some new medicinal stuff I have never heard about. But I am highly, highly impressed with the produce section here at the market. It's just wow, it's awesome. It's got so much fresh stuff. Fresh stuff, huge selection. Oops, sorry. Huge selection. It's just awesome, man. Wow. What a place. Okay, I took the wrong mode. I'm back outside the market. Well, let me take a look. I took a look on this side, see if there's anything to see from here. Oh, yeah, the market continues here, right next to the street. A lot of stuff for sale. You can get your perfumes, perfumes and makeup. Well, it's nice, Aki. Okay. <laughs> it smells really good with the perfume. It's very hot, different kind of perfumes, that's why. I know this, I know this. I just come close here, and like, man, it smells good. Yeah. Every day you sell perfume or just Saturdays? Only Saturdays. Only Saturdays, every Saturday out there. So, Saturday is the busy day in the market. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Nice, thank you. Running W meat. Oh, look here. The chicken truck is here. Running W, running W meats. Look at this. That ground beef, you guys got sausage, you got sausage, all kind of stuff, too. Got everything. Yeah, wow. look at that. Wow, Italian sausage. This is Kayo made, Kayo made products. Running W. Made here, right outside of, right outside of San Ignacio. They got the processing plant. 
Do you guys come out here selling every Saturday? Every yes, Saturday from Nine 6. From 6 in the till morning 11. till 11. Wow. Cool. Yeah, Rodding W. I had Rodding W. Good stuff. Very good stuff. Uh, here we have the local, this is the free chicken, quality chicken from the Mennonites. The Mennonite chicken. Mennonites produce pretty much all the chicken here in Belize. They've got huge chicken plants. And here in Belize, we eat, we eat lots of chicken. We eat chicken almost every day in Belize. Look at that. And what do we have here? Here we got another chicken one. Caribbean chicken. From Blue Creek in Orange Rock. Wow, they come all the way here at Processing Plant. Orange Rock in the house. So Orange Rock in the house here. Yes, sir. All right. Major. You guys come all the way from Orange Rock to sell chicken here. Yep. That is cool. Every Saturday. Yeah. Right. Wow. So I'm finding out Saturday is market day in San Ignacio. Can you believe it? These guys come all the way from Orange Rock. All the way San Ignacio and sell chicken. Right next to the competition, right? Who got, who got better chicken? They said the better chicken? All right. <laughs> I was hoping you'd say that. Yeah, I was, I was hoping you'd say that. <laughs> That's a tricky question. Who has the better chicken, him or the guy parked next to him? <laughs> Coconut time. Morning. So what you guys, oh, you guys sell meat? Yes, sir. Country meats. Made here in, in Cayo or somewhere else? Spanish Lookout. Oh, made in Spanish Lookout. Country meat, guys. What kind of meat you all sell? Beef and pork. Beef and pork. Sausages, all that Sausage stuff too? too. Wow, nice. Yes, okay, we got coconut. Tiene coco con un popote? Yes. I want, I need one coconut with a straw. Look at these coconuts, guys. Huge pile. Coconuts. Sweet, sweet. Coconut here guys. Traffic jam, look at that. Traffic jam in San Ignacio. So let me guess itself a coconut to drink. They got a straw. Because I, I hate drinking coconut the way they do it like that. But I gotta get all of my shit. I'm I'm incredibly messy. I cannot drink coconuts that way. Anything I do. I, I, I've gotten these different colored YouTube shirts. What do you guys think about them? As you probably noticed, I got red and blue and, and green. I got orange. I got a fluorescent yellow. I got a, a black. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'll get my straw. And I love it, guys. Classic, plastic straw. Yes, yeah, so I got these different color YouTube shirts and um, I think I'm switching back to full black because I'm just too damn messy for these colored ones. Look at my coconut here. Freshly picked yesterday or this morning. Wow, it's so good. So, so good. And they got piles. And they put it in buckets. How come you guys put it in buckets? Por qué ponen en en el balde o lo ponen en botellas para vender? Para empacarlo en botellitas. Oh. Empaca en botellitas. Oh, see here. Empaca en small. Uh huh. Liter. Ah, como vende el small y como vende el liter. El liter six. Ah, small bottle three dollars. Small one is three dollars. The liter is six dollars. A gallon. Oh, you can get you. Twenty dollars. Twenty dollars per gallon. Of coconut water wow are you guys come here every saturday every saturday todos los días every day every day huh? sunday to sunday every yeah. single day they're out here selling wow are the coconuts from your farm or, or you buy them 
the cobras. Sí, cobras. Yeah, they say they buy the coconuts, and then here they sell the bottle. Guys, my camera heating, overheating is starting already, but I'm enjoying this coconut with a plastic straw. And I'll see you in a little bit. I'll enjoy this. I'll let the camera cool off. Here from the coconut lady. You know the coconut lady? <laughs> <laughs> the guy laughs, I call it a coconut lady. Oh, 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 and it's a coconut mister. Coconut man. Coconut man and coconut lady. Yeah, that's good. That's good. I like what you guys are doing. Healthy. Huh? That's your husband? Yes. Uh, he laughed when I call it a coconut lady. <laughs> yep, you got a lot of coconuts. Wow, how many coconuts you got in that pile? Como cuantos tienes allá? 1,300 coconuts. Can you imagine that, guys? Damn, ¿y cómo sale una así? $3. Ah, $3? This is three bucks. $3 Belize. That's a dollar fifty US fresh coconut right off the tree. Yum, yum. Yeah. Can't get healthier than this. I like my Coke Zero, but coconut is good too. No water, no sugar. Pure, right out of the, right out of the coconut. No water added, no sugar added, no preservatives added. The real deal. Better actually than Coke Zero, but I'm so addicted to that Coke Zero. Here at the market in San Ignacio. Look at this place, this place is busy. But let me drink my coconut and I'll see you in a little bit. So guys, from Mr. and Mrs. Coconut, here in San Ignacio. Gracias por el coco sabroso. Tres dólares. Buen deal. Thank you guys. Three dollars Belize. Dollar fifty US. For coconut. Fresh. Fresh coconut. Pure coconut water. I mean absolutely the best. Make sure you come and give them guys some business when you're here in San Ignacio. They're right here along the street. They park here. Along the street side while the cars go by. So they're easy to find. They won't be mixed in with among a bunch of stores out in here, you know, which could get a little tricky. It gets it's busy in there. So let's go explore some more and see what we find. Okay, even Menace here. Hi, what do you sell? Cheese? Yes. Yes, so cheese. Yeah. What kind of cheeses do you have? Um, this is just regular cheese. Regular cheese? Yeah. Oh, yeah. How much for a bag like this? It's $7. $7 Belize. 350 yeah. US, guys. Regular cheese. This one is 350 Uh-huh. So only one kind of cheese you sell? Uh, we had them um, with pepper also, but it's finished. Oh, you had with pepper? Wow, that would be nice. Yeah. Pepper and cheese. This is... In Spanish they call it racasun. What? Racasun. 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 Oh yeah. yeah. I got no idea what racasun is. It looks good though. Cottage cheese. Oh cottage cheese. Ah yeah. Six dollars. Cool. Which community you live in? Lower Barton Creek. Nowhere? Lower Barton Creek. Nowhere Barton Creek. Wow. Place I've never heard of in my life. <laughs> nice meeting you. What's your name? Abraham Friesen. Abraham Friesen. Nice meeting you, man. Where are you I, from? I'm originally from Canada, British Columbia, Canada. Okay. But I grew up in Corsal Town. Okay. I have a brother in Canada. Yeah? Yeah. In Alberta, I bet you. Alberta? I know, because you guys are all in Alberta. Yeah, a lot of, <laughs> lot of Mennonites. You're Mennonite, how much? We're Mennonite. Mennonite, yeah. A lot of Mennonites I know in Alberta, yeah. Okay. Where it's cold. You been there? You been already to Alberta? No, I been never there. You you born and born and grew up in Belize. Yes. Yeah, that's good. That's good. <laughs> Alberta is cold, man. Okay. So you contact with you then? Um, not really. Not really, yeah. <laughs> you know the Plattdeutsch? My yeah. father, my father could speak Plattdeutsch yeah, because my fa my father is German. Mm -hmm. He can speak the low German. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, really, because when, where he grew up, that's all they used to speak. Okay. Yeah. All right. Nice meeting you. Yeah. 
there we go Mena is here selling their cheese and stuff and whoa he was a nice guy willing to talk to the camera because they're very shy most of the time and he is a Mennonite born and raised in Belize he's never even been to Canada a lot of them do come from Canada here some come from South America and then they have the ones who are born and raised here oh a lot of them come from Mexico too but he's born in Belize raised in Belize Belizean to the bone yeah this fruit and veggie section of never ceases to amaze me it's got so much fresh 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 stuff I gotta walk I gotta right. capsule up ceilings are too low I gotta walk by the preacher lady again she got a passion for what she's doing she got a passion for what she's doing wow you guys will love it here you guys watching from other countries you come here to this market man you will love it it's just great lots of food for sale wow pupusas how much for the pupusas 250 for one Look at that, Salvadorian pupusas made fresh, fresh on the spot by the ladies here. Nice, they look nice. Every every day you sell pupusas or just Saturdays? Monday and Saturday. Monday and Saturday. Ah oh, yeah. Monday and Saturday here. Pupuseria Damares. I guess that's boss right there. Oh yeah, that's her. That's you right there, right? Yeah. All right, she's the boss. Pupuseria Damaris, 250 Belize for pupusas, a buck 25 US. You meet me again, look, we could get pupusas here. Yeah. I know. She, she makes sure they know who's the boss here, puts her photo. <laughs> Very good. Yeah. Uh, I am ready to go eat. You're ready to go eat? Where you want to go eat? This thing keeps on turning it off. It gets hot, hot, yeah. Yeah, when you do it long, um, right? I don't know. I, I, I shut this. for one, there's something there. Guys, I gotta shut this off a bit so it cools off. So where you Maria's oh. camera is turning off with the heat. Mine shut off once already. Right, sorry. Yeah. You can take up. Well, it's time for breakfast. We're getting a little hungry. It's 9.15. 9.15, it's breakfast time. And uh, the markets pretty always much have... It, pretty much food. it will be brunch. Yeah, markets always have the best food. So let's see what we find. I think I saw the fogon or something. Fogon? Oh, over here? Uh -huh. Alright, let's go check it out. Hopefully, ha hopefully they have something good that we like. Will you sit out here on a bench? I, I want to oh, they, go got, on they got tables too, I think. Yeah, on the short one. Because here we are at El Fogon de Cayo. Let's go try it out. Let's see what kind of food they have. Let's see if we get a table and a chair. Good morning, everybody. They have kind of picnic style. Oh, and there we got a table. I think I'm going to clean your table. <laughs> <laughs> it sounds like the place for us. El Fogon del Cayo. 
and it's located right next to the bridge where we walked over I don't know if it's gonna be the same video or yesterday's video from Santa Elena into San Ignacio they have this little wooden thing here and they got set up a little restaurant do you know why they have these bags if you know why let me know in the comments I'll tell you why no, I want them to answer me and tell me why. Why do they have these bags? Let me know. In case your fish escape. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Where's the goldfish? Let me know if you know why they use these bags. They're hanging all around this place. Ancient secret. Hey guys, our food is finally here. What did we wait like half an hour? Pretty much it's like half an hour, yeah. Yeah, so food is here. I got my burger. Check it out. I got 11 french fries, $5 US. For you, Maria, she ordered shrimp quesadillas. But, but they turn into chicken. But they brought a chicken quesadillas, they mistake the order. How much did that cost? Also 10? I don't know. I don't remember what that cost. No, it's more. I think it's 11, I don't know, 12 or 15. Yeah. But chicken, I don't know. <laughs> 11 fries, please. <laughs> what am I going to do with 11 fries? Eat them. The burger looks okay, but yeah. little, no, little small. It's a little small, but all right. You'll have you learn. Having breakfast at the market. I'm having a burger for breakfast because you know it is 10 o'clock in the morning. So, let me enjoy the food. See you later. El Fogón del Cayo. El Fogón del Cayo. Come here for your 11 fries and your mini burger. I bet it's good though. I bet it looks it looks like it's very tasty. Guys, I don't want to piss nobody off, but um, the food here was mediocre at best. The 11 french fries and um, the meat was overcooked. It was tough. It had a good taste because it's 100% pure beef. But it was highly, like they say in Belize, if you not born, you not done. Well, that burger may born because it may over done. Yeah. So yeah, you guys might be upset. Some people won't like it, they'll get mad at me. But then, um, just the truth, it was good. The quesadilla wasn't that good either. Too. No, I ordered shrimp and they gave me chicken. And um, it took half an hour. And besides that, um, I didn't taste no, 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 um, no cheese. Yeah, it was very, very cheap on the cheese, the quesadilla, very and also, cheap. And also, the tortillas, they gave me a giant tortilla, but nothing inside. So I, I wish they would only give me a little piece of tortilla, but the filling, you know? So. Yeah, so. I won't come back. Um, I, I, sorry, if I'm, going, I'm very sorry, but I have to give you a thumbs down. It, was, it wasn't the best. It wasn't the best. I was hoping for something good. But I eat a lot of burgers. I know about burgers. <laughs> so let's go explore some more markets. Let's go. Well, sorry to El Fogon, but the food was a little disappointing. But hey, that's life. So let's head, show you a little bit more the market to finish off the video. At what? <laughs> the hand woven baskets. All handmade. Oh, that's a nice stuff. Look, they got the hummingbirds too, you see? Yeah. Those are the. There is a lot of nice stuff here, guys. What is going on here? Oh, I hear they got the classic. Let me see, let me check it out. I want to see. Classic gambling trick. There's always a, a trick over it though. Sir, don't. You can't film illegal gambling? Sir, he has a license to gamble. He has a license to gamble? Yes, sir, right. he has. Okay. So, he has a license to do. He, he has. 
Can you believe that, guys? This guy is doing the, you know, the thing we have to guess. And the cop actually told me I can't film it because he has a license to scam people. Wow. Shame on you, whoever allows him to do that. That is a joke. Here in the market. <laughs> I guess he paid off somebody. God, there's no way. No way you can have a license to be scamming poor people, you know? Innocent people who think they're gonna get rich. Yeah. What do you got, PG man? You alright? Yeah, yeah, do I eat karaoke? Yeah, yeah, do I eat karaoke? Karaoke, what do you call it? Karaoke time? You never video so many? Huh? You never video so many? I video, I leave it, yeah. I make, try make one leave video out of it. Alright. Yep. Here's more food courts, guys. Look at this. There's a lot of, a lot of food available around here. All kind of nice stuff. All kind of nice stuff. Market in San Ignacio. No, I'm truly impressed. I'm truly impressed. This market can compete even with some of the bigger markets in Mexico. It's it's awesome. I am very you guys can be proud of your market. You guys got an awesome, cool market. It's super good. A lot of food stuff. Hello, what are you guys selling here? We are selling tacos, burritos, fried chips, rice and beans, white rice. Wow, good stuff. All right, thank you. A lot of good food here. Everybody's eating. We should have ate around here. Probably would have had a better meal. Hi. Well, that was the market here in San Ignacio. I give it two thumbs up, one thumb, two thumbs up. Really nice. It's big, it's got everything you want. They got good food. All right, buddy, how's it going, buddy? How's things going? Cool, man, talk to this, my friend, right here. This is, this is, I know him, I know him. I met him already. Uh-huh. Yeah, right? Yeah. Bye. Bye. So guys, I truly enjoyed this market. I'm glad I came here. You come to San Ignacio, come to the market on a Saturday. It's great. And if you do your shopping here, they've got everything. It's a wonderful market. Thank you for giving me the tip to come here. I'm glad I did. So until next time, bye bye. Still here guys, I told where are you Maria? about the coconut water so we're gonna get a bottle of coconut water to I'm busy soaking on this guys yeah mm. Chamo, yada. Mm -hmm. mango mango yeah. it's good I taste it it's delicious eight bucks Belize or US but am I told about the coconut water so we're gonna get a, a bottle of coconut water to take back to the room the hotel we're staying in there's actually a uh, communal fridge where everybody could put stuff in so I'm back to the coconut lady and her husband and we're gonna get a bottle of coconut wow. what? yellow coconut yeah wow what size you want the liter 
well, of course the bigger the better. Dude. They have a gallon. <laughs> they have a gallon, but you want a gallon? Uh, I don't know if it will fit in the yeah, fridge. Yeah, that'd be no. too much. Yeah. It won't fit. In yeah, the a liter bottle would be better. <laughs> yeah, regresamos. <laughs> All right, try go me a esposa. They laugh when I said the bigger the better. <laughs> <laughs> well, you buy one, one liter, one liter. One liter. Yeah. What's the gallon? One liter. One liter. Nice. Salad. I don't buy already. Really, really good. Nice yeah. allowance. Six dollars for this, and you get the whole gallon for twenty dollars. That you got for the whole week. God, the whole week, one day and a half. And so on. Well, it depends on how you <laughs> drink, it. drink it. I got it. I need a gallon. Too. Oh, she chops it. Oh, and then they sift it. Le pone para que para que no entre basura. Aha. Very good idea. And the yellow coconut is the best one, huh? I gave her a name, I gave, called her Coconut Lady and her husband laughs. <laughs> so guys, we got a liter of coconut water. Is my camera on? Yes it is. We got a liter of coconut water from that pile there. Thank you. We're gonna enjoy this tonight. Get your fresh coconut water there. And they keep it with ice, so it's ice cold. And our hotel room has a fridge, so we're gonna keep it in the fridge and sip from it. So now, from San Ignacio. How much was that? Six dollars, Belize. Okay. Three dollars US. Right. From San Ignacio, Belize, now I'm really gone. Bye bye. All right, try some beans only for seven dollars, cupcake one dollar. Come and get, come and support these kids go back to school. But ladies and gentlemen, don't be afraid. You can take a pressure right here to go Belize, go Belize.